just like mystery, alibi, yeah. DCCRA, cook beats. Faces just like the sun. All right, all right, what's up? What's going on, everybody out there? This is your boy, Alibi. I'm hanging out right here on the fields, you know what I mean? I'm enjoying the spot. I'm enjoying everything about this place, and I want to talk about a lot of things. First of all, from my new single, Mommy Water. Controversial, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, after the uh, the success of my very first single, first major single being on Banjo, I, I got inspired to write a song called Mommy Water based on certain reasons. One being the fact that um, I, I, I try to, like, you know, express my adoration for a certain girl's beauty, you know what I mean? Because sometimes you see very beautiful girls around and you want to just say something about your beauty. You, you relate their beauty to what you call a mermaid. Like, a whole lot of us in the world would always want to see a girl who's so beautiful and you say, wow, she's like a mermaid. So um, that was the concept behind Mami Wata. Nothing spiritual at all. Please, don't get that confused. Because <laughs> um, I read a lot of things in the blogs and on the internet and people were saying all kinds of things on Twitter. Like, hey, Alibi, you did a banjo and now you're coming up with Mami Wata. Uh, what's, what's the whole Mami Wata thing? Why, is it, why, why does it have to be a banjo, Mami Wata? What's it going to be next? Emirate? Oh, uh, <laughs> I'd be cool. <laughs> But the thing about it, it was, was just that in, in a song like um, Ogbanje, I was virtually just about complaining about a girl's characteristics. You know, uh, when a girl has um, very disturbing characteristics, you just have to like maybe sometimes put you under so much pressure that you just start complaining. So that was, that was the concept behind Ogbanje. In Ogbanje, I was virtually complaining about a girl's character and while in Mami Wata, I was praising a girl's beauty. So you can see the difference between the two songs. It's not just, it's got nothing to do with spirituality. It's got nothing to do with me and the marine spirits. It's about me just expressing my circumstances with girls, with ladies, you know what I mean? Different different characteristics and different different things, you know? I, I find myself complaining in one, in one song and in the other song I was praising the girl, you know? So they're two different things, two different phenomenal characteristics here. So, don't get that confused, all right? Don't don't think it's anything spiritual or I'm serving some kind of spirit god or something like a lot of people say on Twitter and I <laughs> and I see on on the blogs every single day and I'm like, "Oh my god, what have I done to myself?" But it, it, it's fun, you know, because I know people will say things. People will naturally want to say stuff like, "Okay, this guy's got some some spiritual um formation of some sort." Also, some spiritual uh, 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 what I say liaison of some sort. I'm not in any way in any way, please, God, I beg you. <laughs> I beg you guys watching or you guys listening. I have nothing to do with all these spiritual forces you guys attribute alibi to be with. I am not in any way. Uh-uh, not. I don't go there. <laughs> okay. But I was just talking about, you know, like, sometimes you just have to just express yourself. And um, I know it was going to spark some kind of controversy like it is already doing right now. So, but... You guys should always try to understand that someone, a man has a right to express himself whatever way he wants to. And this is music. Music happens to be an art form that you need to express yourself. And I'm expressing myself basically based on the fact that I just have, I find myself in these situations that I just have to express myself using these subject characteristics. One Ogbanje, the other one Mami Water. Two different things. One Ogbanje is a spirit actually. It's like, like some kind of bad spirit. Come on, like being possessed with some 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 wicked spirit of some sort. And my Wata is a mermaid. So I don't see I don't see that that it's it sounds similar, but it's not the same thing. You know, Mami Wata is a mermaid, Ogbanji is a bad evil spirit. So these two things are actually kind of like different. So if you can get the clarity and the and the um the difference between these two subjects, then you can actually understand where I was coming from in these two songs. So there you go. I hope you understand that. The lead for the single, for the video actually, is going to be a, a, a movie actor, a movie actress actually. I wouldn't want to let the cat out of the bag, but she's quite beautiful. And um, we intend to shoot the video before the end of January, hopefully. And um, we're looking at my very favorite director, Clarence Peters. And uh, I, I could tell you that the, the, the girl in the video is going to be quite beautiful. She's going to exemplify that personality that persona, that mermaid persona, trust me, you'll not be disappointed. And you will like the lady you're gonna see in the video. Yes, it will be. It will be. You know, we, we, we're looking at different locations already. We're looking at um, uh, many exotic places in Lagos State, and um, it's gonna be good, trust me. Oh, yeah. 
you guys are welcome. My, my arms are open. I, 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 I welcome everybody who want to support my career, and I think the Fuse is doing a good deal, good deal at that. So, you guys are always going to be welcome, definitely. The album will be popping out this year, hopefully, by the grace of God, before the end of the year. We're looking at the last quarter of the year, or um, towards the last quarter of the year, or second quarter of the year. But it just depends on, um, on what comes up after the Miami Water buzz and everything. We're looking at, uh, we're having a lot of demand recently, and uh, thank God for that. It's it's a question I keep ask, I keep answering every single place I go to. Where is your album coming? When is it coming up? Where when are you going to be releasing your album? And I heard a lot of that, so I think that um, that is that is really making me work hard. I'm working harder at the album, and I'm recording songs and virtually on a daily basis. And I think the album is going to be it's going to be ready before the end of. Let's say the next quarter should be definitely. I was thinking of doing a song with Nas, you know, and um, we we're actually in, in talks with his management. I wrote a song called um, Kingdom Fall, and um, I was looking at Nas for the rap. I'm a, I'm a rapper myself, but uh, I would like to have Nas in it. He's one rapper that actually inspired me a whole lot. Then uh, we're already talking to, the, to his management. Then I'm um, looking at Asha. She's one, one, one singer I really love. Mm, I admire Asha a whole lot. Then Two Face, of course. These are the people I really, really want to like. I would like to have an album, you know. This is very talented people. I like to do a movie, definitely. It's something I've always, I've always looked forward to all my life. Um, I have, I have this enormous acting talent, you know, colossal acting talent, and I think that I like to put that into play. Maybe not this year, maybe sometime next year. But I like to do a big movie, not just. Um, I like to do like a 35 mm movie. You know, celluloid movie, cinema movie, not just any kind of movie, if you know what I mean. You know, so um, I'm looking at, let's just let's just finish the album first. Then after the album, okay, I could be doing some, I might just be the next James Bond. I'm looking at James Bond. My name is Bond, James Bond. <laughs> You know, so uh, we're just we're looking at things like that. But I, I would love to be. I like to do a movie. I've got a lot of scripts lined up already. But um, let's just take it one at a time. Music first, movies later. All right, well, what's up? What's up, everybody? This is your boy Alibi. I like you all to join me on the Fuse exclusive www.thefuse.com.ng.